Ah, ladies and gentlemen, a uh, tad bit different here in the shed because I picked up something and I thought, well, we'll just do a video about this. And uh, one thing uh, I like is the uh, visible uh, anatomy kits. You know, you got the old Renoir, Ravel, uh, visible man, the visible woman, visible horse, you know, visible frog. And uh, this is the Lindbergh one. I didn't get, I never did get the, uh, uh, I'm going to say lifelike. Uh, they probably, did they? Or Lindbergh could have done the uh, a frog. I don't know. I'd have to do my little, uh, do some more research because I don't remember. Uh, but it's one of those, uh, one of those kits where uh, they're cool and they suck at the same time. And the reason I wanted the bullfrog was, uh, you know, hypnotoad. But if you get the kit, you notice the legs are extended so you ain't sitting like a frog. But there is things that you can pick up that... Uh, company uh, anatomy kits is what I like to call them and uh, that was the bullfrog but you can also get the amazing frog and uh, it's a and they're pretty much one to one scale I know the bullfrog is but uh, he is and you do get the uh, you know the skeleton uh, the organs but that one would make an excellent Hypnotoad, and uh, don't know Hypnotoad, the Futurama. You know he won the uh, won the contest, and everyone went. Yeah, it's just one of those one of those things that you know a little add to the arc here that uh, you know stuff you just don't see, but I think it makes a very good very good companion kit uh, to go with the uh, bullfrog. And I've only seen the one. I've never seen any more than uh, that. So, I was uh, uh, at a local garage sale, just a random one, and they had the Magic School Bus. And uh, I don't have a Magic School Bus kit uh, for the shed. I'd like, or, or a school bus to make the. Magic School Bus, because, you know, it was a rocket ship and all that, and, uh, you know, Fantastic Voyage comes to mind, because it did, you know, anatomy, but they had this, uh, the Human Body Lab, and the thing that caught my attention was the uh, skeleton kit. Now, it's missing all the, I don't think it's supposed to get organs, it's supposed to get, like, uh, other uh, literature and all that, but none of that's in there. But the skeleton is intact. And I was like, ah, well, I want it. Because, number one, most of these in this scale are one-sixth. So uh, you can make a skeleton warrior. Jason and the Argonauts always come to mind. Uh, again, I don't know uh, how... Oh, it's got screws. Well... Again, I don't know uh, what type of plastic it is, you know, if paint would adhere to it. But, uh, I wanted the school bus too, because uh, I do like the Magic School Bus, and needs to be a vehicle, you know, to make. But, the skeleton kits. Again, if you get the Invisible Man, the Visible Woman, you know, you can get the uh, skeleton uh, kit to make uh, skeleton warriors if you want. Or you can pick up, like, educational uh type things like this the plastic in here they're almost identical the kit wise is almost identical to the rebel ones i don't know if they took some you know took like i want to say the rebel mold you know and uh used it or you know it was uh similar something brand new i don't know uh but i pick these up all the time because they are uh one six scale skeletons if you really uh however they they and i'll be honest they suck when you put them together because they just don't stick right it's kind of a not really a toy plastic not really styrene just kind of a uh but the details real good on it it's just they they suck at putting uh together even if you're trying to make them a you know a posed uh warrior because I've had a couple of temp ones and I just couldn't make them to stick. They need to be like pinned or something differently than uh, what I did. But anyway, I try to pick these up. I think they're, because uh, they are the same scale as to go with the Rebel, which uh, I didn't want to dig them out. They were buried nicely and I didn't want to disturb the uh, 
the plastic there but I think these uh, turn out really good with uh, you know an added shield added sword you know axe you know and you can have uh, one six scale uh, skeleton warriors especially Jason and the Argonauts but anyway ladies and gentlemen uh, that's what I got going on today I uh, I do occasionally I don't add too much toys into the uh, art or I classify this as I do classify this as a model kit and uh, I do add stuff like this because uh, I I do like the educational I call them educational models because uh, that's what they are but I think they can be used for everything else you know fantasy science fiction you know hypno toad but anyway uh, I wanted to share that because that was something you know usually don't see too much in the hobby world but sometimes in the toy model world you'd kind of see it and uh, you can add it to your uh, collection but anyway ladies and gentlemen that's what I got going on today uh, we're going to add magic school bus and another skeleton uh, to the art so that's what we got going on today stay tuned for next exciting uh, episode